this is the phoenix back to do another energy update for the sign of libra just keep in mind these are general readings they're not going to resonate for all of you but for the ones that it does resonate for please like share comment and subscribe to my channel for those of you interested in a personal reading with me all the information is in the description box below this is going to be for the sun moon rising and venus signs of libra so let's jump into this reading and see what is coming through for you guys this week. A lot of happiness, a lot of good fortune, a lot of blessings within a family unit. So you will be very, very happy within your home and your family life this week or, or till the end of the year. But there is something that still has you feeling trapped something that is still pulling you back something that is making you feel like something is wrong but i do see change coming here it could be a literal move or it could be a change in a mindset but you feel trapped still although there is a lot of happiness coming into you you still feel trapped you are still worried and anxious about something Things are working out within your family unit, but there seems to be something still on your mind burdening you. Mm, could be a relationship although you are feeling very happy during this season there is still a disconnect in a, a, a love relationship where you don't feel the love from this person so it's still making you feel like things aren't working out for you Okay guys, sorry about that. Alright, so it would seem that you're in a relationship and you're questioning the love that is in the relationship. So though you may be having a lot of fun times with your family, you still don't feel the love from your significant other that you used to. Yeah, it's giving you a lot of stress, worry and anxiety. You have a lot of sleepless nights. Because you feel your hands are tied in the situation and you don't know what to do about it. You can't seem to get a breakthrough with this person. It seems that whatever caused the disconnect between the both of you is still actually... It's disconnected. The love and the feelings and the emotions are not there. This person seems to have checked out of the relationship emotionally, if not physically. But some type of change is coming. Is either you are going to change the way you respond to this person or they are going to change the way they respond to you. But you are going to find out something. A secret that has been hidden from you will be exposed. Could be a Pisces you're dealing with. But... You do not feel the love anymore with this person. The love that you both shared at one point in time is no longer there. The happiness that you once had when you saw this person or when you spoke to them, it's not there anymore. Could be a Leo you're dealing with or you, or you could have this in your chart. You want a new beginning and passion, but it's not happening for you. You'd feel very trapped in your situation because for some of you, you could be married to this person, but things are not going the way you had hoped it would. There is definitely a disconnect here. There is a, a feeling of longing of you wanting this person to reconnect with you and love you the way they did before. But it would seem that they are in this energy where they are coming across very cold. 
they they speak to you very directly very harsh for some of you and there is just no emotions to the way they deal with you could be an Aries you're dealing with but this person never really showed much love and affection to you but now you feel the disconnect with this individual and it's making you feel like you're not good enough it's making you feel like what you're trying to do it's not going to work out both of you seem to be a perfectly matched pair or this could be a marriage between a husband and a wife but there is a disconnect between the both of you as regards to emotions and love how do you get this back how do you get this relationship back that is what some of you are saying but you are waiting patiently and hoping that things will change you're being optimistic about this person returning to you and being in love with you again because it breaks your heart the disconnect between the both of you now you may still be living in the same house with this person but you don't feel the love coming off of this person like you used to this person is just cold and distant from you yeah you've been waiting for them to communicate with you to tell you what is wrong to try to fix this but it has not come it is just it's like this person is no longer in the relationship with you you feel very lonely could be a aries leo or sad you're dealing with but the more you try to connect to this person it's like the further they are going from you yeah they're very argumentative controlling manipulative they quarrel a lot it seems like you could never say or do anything right for this person but a new cycle is opening up for you so something new is coming in but you're giving up on ever getting this relationship back with this person there is no emotions here this relationship is just empty where love is concerned and you are quite emotional about this and you tend to lash out at this person because you want them to feel something but the honest emotion that you seem to get from this person is anger is frustration and you are trying to decide what it is you want or you have made the decision as to what it is you want you want to confront this person you want to ask this person exactly what is happening why this disconnect is happening why you guys can't move past whatever it has happened between the both of you could be an aries that you're dealing with but it would seem like this person doesn't care to have a new beginning with you yeah you feel this person constantly lying and manipulating you but the tower moment is coming it's either you're going to find out something or you're going to have a realization or this person is about to have those things the relationship is not being offered back to you could be a water sign you're dealing with scorpio pisces or cancer but you're ready to move on from this you're ready to have some type of change in the situation so i think you're going to be confronting this person sooner or later and you're going to let them know if they can't change you're no longer wasting your time on trying to fix this relationship it may come as a surprise to them or it may come as a surprise to you but there is definitely a shake-up that is happening here for you guys it's either a realization or it's an actual shake-up in your environment 
it could have to do with a Sagittarius. You could be a Sagittarius. Uh, you could be dealing with a Sagittarius, or you could have it in your chart. But it doesn't seem like this relationship can be fixed. I think that is the realization you are going to come to, or this person is going to come to. But somebody is still withdrawing. Somebody is still holding back. Somebody is still being very cold. And the connection between you and them, it's not happening. It's like they refuse to have a coming together with you. But you do have stability and long-term commitment from them. So this is going to be a very long journey of no emotions and no love. But you can't seem to find the clarity how to fix this, how to get this person back to fall in love with you. And you're giving up on the relationship. You're giving up on this ever working out between you and them. It's like you're tired of trying to force someone to love you. To force someone to give you what they can't or what they won't. It's hard for you to know that you love this person so much and they don't have any emotions for you. It is difficult. And you do feel that lost and you do feel that longing for this person. But it would seem that this person is no longer caring to connect to you. And you are constantly emotional about this and constantly trying to figure out where do I go from here? What action do I take? What direction do I move into? There's a lot of pain in this reading. There's a lot of hurt here. Some of you might choose to walk away from this or this person may walk away from you. You want to be happy again. You want to have the sunshine on this relationship again. You want this person to love you. But it's one constant struggle after another. One obstacle after another. There seems to be endless battles that you have to constantly keep fighting. But you do love this person. They are your wish fulfillment and you just want things to be fixed between you and them. Eventually, you will have your wish fulfilled. And you will actually get a relationship that will be loving kind and there will be growth in it. I'm not sure if it's with this person though. This is a message from the divine, something that, mess uh, something that divine wants you to know. It's time to leave the past behind. Look at the journey, not the destination. So it is time to leave, for some of you, it is time to leave the past behind. These are love messages that you would like to say to this person or this person may want to say to you. Your smile brightens my day in ways you'll never truly understand. You smell so good, I lose my focus when you're near. So, we know that you have a lot of love for this person. So, I would guess those are messages from you to them. Alright? So, this is what I have for you guys. I hope it does help. Have a good one.